while we're heading back out on the field. We're still in safety. Safety goes up to the post here. So he thinks we're hunting. Kimi does, but we're really not. Oh, now he is. Yeah, he was hunting as soon as he got out of the car. Kimi, wait for me. Come here. Had to put Mika back in the car. Mika is uh, 12 and a half, and like all labs, they don't know when to stop. You have to tell them. It kills me to put him in the car. It doesn't uh, bother me as much as it bothers him. He is super competitive, and he will just, he would stay all day out here. But uh, he's in the car with a snack, and Kimi and I are going to head back out here and see if we can't drum up another pheasant or two. Or so nice out here. It's cold. It's cold. It's probably it feels like it's colder than when we got started. So, Kimi, 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 whoa! Come here. I'm gonna guess it's with that wind. The wind chill's gotta be near zero, but I think the regular temperature is about 18. Alrighty. gonna fly. Another one of those guys, huh? Make him fly! Make him fly! Yes. Alrighty. Good boy. Drop. 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 Stay. What are we gonna do with this guy? Make him fly? Sit. Sit. You gotta sit. Stay. No, no. That was a shot. Good boy. Right here, right here. Okay, drop. 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 You need to drop. Drop the bird. Drop the bird. Thank you. Too excited, huh? Yes, good boy. That's a good boy. That's a chucker. Good boy. All right, sit. Good boy. Yeah, yeah, I'm uh, glad uh, got the bird to go back up again because I hate having to. Nah, it's, you know, I don't want to have to kill the bird in my hand. The, uh, the ring neck we took earlier, I brought it back to the car and I was kind of hoping it was going to bleed out of my. I hate to say it, but I was hoping it would bleed out of my jacket and it didn't. And, uh,. I'm not one for breaking necks, so uh, I just kind of held them real tight and expired. But uh, I really hate that part. Just assume, uh, shoot them and get it over with and move on. Well, you know, the greatest part about this, you know, it's not about the uh, birds or even the guns and the shooting, it's about the dogs. They just absolutely love this. It's, it's, uh, you know, we, we cook up all the game that we, that we shoot. And, uh, got some great recipes for a pheasant. Keeps wanting to go back over to this spot here. It's the third time we've been over here today. What is there? Something over there? You keep looking, but you never find it. Something you like in there, huh? Uh-huh. Okay, come on. There's nothing in there. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Good boy. And of course, with all hunting, there's the importance of proper etiquette. 
such as keeping your safety on until it's time to shoot. Kimi! Come. I heard that too. Come. Never putting your finger on the trigger until it's until you uh, are ready to shoot the gun. And of course you don't want to point it at anybody. And of course since we're by ourselves, that means you don't want to point it at your at your buddy out here. Because if you lose him, your day's gonna be ruined. And that's why we uh, didn't get that first bird, because it wasn't a safe shot. But that's okay. Over here. And if you ever see these things on the ground, pick them up. Because somebody else didn't. It keeps the place clean. Okay, boy, let's go. Look for birds. Come on, hunt them up. Hunt them up. 